Thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. Um, you've re you're in Jackie's Kitchen. Today we will be um, going over how to make a beef salsa dip and it is keto style. We're going to use the recipe out of this keto slow cooker cookbook that I got from Amazon. And I will post the link in my bio so you guys can, um, or in the description. I wanted to show you that I actually did get this recipe from this book. And we're going to go ahead and show you how to make this beef salsa dip. It's basically a rotel dip, but healthier. What you'll need for the recipe is garlic powder. You'll need Cavender's meat seasoning. I like to use Cavender's meat seasoning. If you have another seasoning you like, that's fine. All purpose seasoning is fine as well. This is just what I like. And we're going to be using onion powder. I did use a teaspoon of each seasoning. We will need Velveeta Original. You'll need the whole block. If you don't want to make the whole block, that's perfectly fine. I think I made most of the whole block. I had a little bit of cheese left. Um, you'll also need the fresh cilantro salsa. It doesn't have to be this particular kind. You can get any type of fresh salsa. This has five calories in it with no carbo uh, carbs, so that's great. Also, I like to use the Tostino's Lightly Salted 50% less sodium chips. And we have our uh, salsa dip over here. Now they call it beef salsa dip, but I use ground turkey, just FYI. So you can use either or beef or turkey. What I did was I ground it. I basically uh, browned my ground turkey and I put the seasonings inside the meat while they were cooking. I lightly drained the meat when it was done and I poured it over into the crock pot. I did cut up the cubes and put the salsa in the crock pot before I put the meat in there. And I let it cook for about 15 minutes uh, before the meat went into the crock pot. You will need 32 ounces of uh, salsa. So that's how much salsa you'll use. Once you have everything over into the crock pot, you're gonna stir it like I'm showing you. And it is going to be thick like this, that's okay. I stress to people, do not put water or milk into your salsa your beef salsa dip or your rotel dip, whichever one you make, do not put milk or water in it. It's going to slow cook and create the texture that you want from it. So basically it's a little thick, but I'm just showing you, this is what it looks like as you're going to stir it all together. It's a little thick, but it's going to be very delicious. I promise y'all. Um, and this is a healthier version. So you have to understand that it's not going to have all of the calories and uh, carbs that a can of Rotel would have in it. We are using fresh produce salsa, but this is what it's going to look like. And you just keep stirring it. You wanna get those cheeses and salsa all mixed together. Now you wanna cook it on high for one hour. You wanna go ahead and let this cook on high for one hour. Um, as you're stirring it, you wanna get this texture going. So stir it as long as you like. I would say you can stir for about three to four minutes, not even that long, honestly, just stir it up and then put the top on it and let it cook for one hour in the crock pot with the top on. One hour, you guys. This is what your Rotel or your beef salsa dip will look like. And I apologize, I'm saying Rotel because I'm so used to making Rotel, but this is what the beef salsa dip will look like. And in my case, I'm using ground turkey. This is the consistency that you will get. This looks like a Rotel or a salsa dip or a cheese dip. Only thing is it's keto style, so it's healthier. This is what your beef salsa dip will look like if you use beef or your ground turkey. Now, I will point this out. If you use beef, the meat will be a little bit darker. I have ground turkey, so my meat is lighter, but um, this is the consistency you want. This is the consistency you will get when you make your beef salsa dip. This is keto style. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe. If you like this video, click the like button, the thumbs up button, and also subscribe to my channel, you guys. This is keto style. You can still enjoy your chips and dip the healthier way. Less sodium, less carbs overall better for you and i like to use ground turkey so that's even better for your digestive system if you personally ask me i'm not a doctor but i'm just saying <laughs> 
But I hope you guys enjoy this. Again, it's not going to be as tasty as you would make when you make regular Rotel, but it is healthier. And if you put it in your mind, honestly, it'll taste the same. This is a keto beef salsa dip. Thank you guys so much. Have a good one.